People still love lives. They love connecting with you. Yeah. So I, I do use uh, live videos a lot in my customer VIP group. That's just where I connect with them. I go on and, and talk about products. I do style, you know, tips, things like that, that, that people want. And I, I think that that's important because it shows your personality and, you know, people like to see who you are. And, and sometimes I'm with the kids or they're coming in and out and things are crazy <laughs> and all the other moms are going, I'm right there with you. <laughs> you know, I yeah. totally understand because this is life, you know, we're at yeah. home, we're working and that is our business. Yeah. And, you know, I, I use, you know, I use social media for everything. Our, my team chats, like messenger is the, like the number one place that I um, communicate with my team. I use my stories to pull in new customers, but also to connect with my current customers there. So I mean, I'm, I'm on social media all the time. Mostly on Facebook is my, the platform that I have chosen to use. Yeah. And it, I don't know what I would do if it failed. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope Facebook keeps working because. That's another conversation really for another day. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah. And we have tried other things thinking, well, what if it's not going to work? You know, yeah. what if we need to, you know, we've tried YouTube stuff and Instagram stuff. And it's just, we always tend to come back yeah. to Facebook. Thank you for joining us in this episode of the Direct Selling Accelerator podcast. If you love listening and you found that this was helpful for your direct selling business, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also check out the recommended video that's popped up on your screen right here. I look forward to seeing you again next time. Bye.